given him something earlier yesterday to help him re release his bowels and he couldn't sit up on the commode because it was hurting his back and, and he just wasn't going at that point. So they put him back in bed and put him on a bedpan which also irritated his back and they only let you lay on the bedpan for 15 minutes because of bed sores. So, after that, then he was just having accidents in the bed. Um, they put you on a, a pad, but then they have to come and they have to roll you and clean you and everything. Well, rolling him back and forth and everything and having him sitting on the commode for such a long period of time was really irritating his back and his leg and everything. So he was in a lot of pain all night long. And they gave him his Dilaudid and then a doctor came in this morning and gave him some extra Dilaudid. Pretty tired. Right now I'm going to probably try and catch more a little bit more sleep and we will catch you guys all a little bit later. Good morning everybody. Had a great morning so far. I woke up and uh, all the power's off in the house. So since it's uh, really hot in the middle of August, I thought, well, maybe we had a power outage, but no, nope, the electricity was turned off at our house. No uh, advance notice, no nothing, just turned it off. So that's fun. So I give them a call and they said, well, we called you, but you didn't answer and you can't leave a message. And uh, so switch, turned it off. Supposed to have it turned on sometime later on today. So far, um, no power. Sopa, the doctors just came in and what did they tell you? And I'm going home. When? E.T. going home. <laughs> Phone home. <laughs> when are you going home? Tomorrow. Yeah. Hopefully the pain ain't too bad when I start moving around and go. The more you move, the better it's going to be, is what yeah, the doctor said. So, I mean, I don't know what time. It's only nine o going on nine, so I won't go to work until this afternoon sometime. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so. You excited, though? Yeah, Nervous? Yeah, in a way. Nervous? Yeah. You, you got this, Dad. You got it. Yeah, I know. You got I it. I just hope everything functions okay again now. Well, they told you why you weren't going to the bathroom. You had a bladder infection. Yeah, I know. So. You got a lot of people praying, so power of prayer. Yeah. <laughs> so the therapist yeah. can use that with yeah. <sighs> Kind of dark in here, but. Doing good. How you feeling? Any pain? Any pain? Uh, just in the hip. Are you bending your knee? To, uh -huh. are, do you bend your knee to get that foot going? No. You have to bend your knee? Or, you're doing good, right? And a little bit in the leg because of, I don't know. <laughs> what number is your pain right now in the hip? Uh, no, I very little. Probably about three or four. Okay. We'll go straight. Uh, yep. Okay, guys, 
The lone wolf is at it again. We're gonna run this time. <laughs> well, hey everybody. We just had a really bad scare and um, my dad was supposed to be going home tomorrow and unfortunately he's not gonna be going home tomorrow. He went for his walk today and he was more tired today than he was yesterday, but he did do his walk. And then he was sitting in the chair in his room instead of back in his bed. And he felt like he was gonna get sick, so he started throwing up. And then the nurses came in and gave him some Zofran, which is for nausea. So we put him back into bed and then they decided to put a patch on the back of his ear here for nausea. Well, my mom, my Aunt Barbara, and I took a walk, and we went and we found something to eat, and we came upstairs, and he was sleeping, and we ate. We ordered his dinner, and it came, and we tried to wake him up, and he wouldn't wake up. Um, so after shaking him for a while and buzzing the nurses and stuff, he did wake up, um, but he was unresponsive. Um, so... We had like four doctors come into the room, like six nurses. Um, anyway, long story short is he is awake and aware now. Um, everything was normal except his blood pressure was very, very high. His heart was okay. He was answering questions. All in all, um, He's okay now, but it doesn't look like they're going to let him go home tomorrow. And um, we think that it was the patch, because that was the only thing different that they had done. And I just spoke with Kevin, and at one time he had that patch on, and that patch made him like that for about, he slept for like 24 hours, he said, with that patch on. So, And my aunt, who is a nurse as well, she also said that that patch can do that to you. So they're going to keep a close eye on him um, all night tonight. Of course, I'm going to be sleeping here again and keeping a close eye on him myself. And um, we're going to be here another night at least. So we'll catch you guys all a little later. Okay, so they turned my power back on. Uh, of course, I had to jump through all of their hoops to do it. Uh, they really shouldn't have ever turned it off, but uh, that's the way they're going to behave. Uh, the whole thing is because of the solar panels on the roof. They never told us how they were going to charge, and it was the most ridiculous thing we ever heard. And so they were going to charge us only once a year for the power instead of monthly. And even though we were getting monthly bills with small amounts on it, we thought, oh, great, we, we're really doing well. And we get slapped with a, a bill in January, just as I lost my job, saying that we owed them $1,000. So we set up a, a um, payment plan with them, which was going fine, and I was late on the last payment. Paid them. I was late. They shut me down without calling me, without sending me a text, without anything. So... That's how they're going to behave, and that's really interesting. Thanks, Con Ed. So, everybody, my dad is back to sleep. <laughs> it was a very interesting day, but it's over. I know I didn't do a lot of filming today, but wasn't a lot to film. So... I hope you like this video. Please give it a great big thumbs up. Keep those thoughts and prayers coming along for the lone wolf. And press that little red subscribe button down below and follow along. And we got some exciting things going on here, obviously. And share this video with your family and friends. And keep track of the lone wolf. And just when will he be golfing? Dun, dun, dun.